How's it going guys? So, Modern Horizons is the next update to reach Horizon 5. It's going to release next week and we're going to hear all about it on Monday. This video is taking a look at all the clues we've got. We already have one confirmed car. We're going to have a look at the other clues that we have and try and figure out what's going to come in that update and see how close we are to getting it right. Let's get straight to it. So if we have a look at the splash screen for the next upcoming update, as I said, it is Mozen, Mozen, Modern Horizons. It's going to have a highly requested car, new events, new event lab props, and a new collectible. Now, let's firstly show straight away the car that is already confirmed. Over on the Forza Horizon Twitter page, they have shared a little graphic announcing the next stream. And what's on the graphic? picture of a new car, the Ionic 5N. They always do this around a week or so before they announce an update. They post some kind of picture announcing the live stream and within that there is often one of the new cars. So the Ionic 5N is coming to Horizon 5 next week in Modern Horizons. It's a relatively modern car. It's definitely following the theme that it sounds like it's going to be modern cars for Modern Horizons so we can expect all the other cars to be modern along with this Ionic as well. Another thing that was tweeted today over on the Spanish for a Horizon page as I like to keep an eye on the French and the Spanish and all the other ones just because sometimes they have exclusive stuff. Um, the Spanish KFC have done a promotion or collaboration with Forza Horizon 5 and Xbox and it seems like if you pay if you play a particular event lab you can see the event lab code on the screen right now if you play that share a clip of you playing it with a hashtag you'll get it translates to you'll get a menu of five strips for free I presume that means you'll get five chicken strips for free. This is probably only eligible in Spain. This might be because the Spanish Grand Prix is next week. I'm actually going to be there myself if any of you guys are there. Keep an eye out for me. They call it the KFC Auto Grand Prix, so a bit of a promotion there. I don't really know what it's about. It's probably not anything to do with the next update, but I still thought I'd show you guys because it's quite random and interesting. So, Modern Horizons, as I said. Now, the first thing to take note of is obviously it's saying we're getting a highly requested car. Now, a few people have got this mixed up with the most requested car. And I have to remind you all that this doesn't say most requested car. Now, at this current moment in time, at least when this series was announced, the most requested car, and I think it still is, the Mercedes SLR McLaren. It's not that that we're getting. I'd be very surprised if that's the car that we're getting because if we go back a few months, the Dia de Muertos update had the most requested car widget and that was the Nissan Suru. So I think if we were getting the top most requested car, it would say most requested car. This just says highly requested car. So it's probably in the top 20, but not necessarily that one. This on screen right now is what the top 20 most voted cars looked like a couple of months ago when this update was probably first announced. It is slightly different now, but it's generally the same. So because it says highly requested car, I'd put a lot of money on at least one car on this list right now being added to the game next week. Obviously, we're going to presume that it's one of the modern ones. The series, after all, is called Modern Horizons, so we can presume that the highly requested car is a modern car. So we can rule out the Fiat Uno, we can rule out the Chevrolet Chevy, we can rule out the Lexus. There's quite a lot that we can rule out there. And the ones that stand out to me are the Toyota Yaris at the top. We don't know what type of Toyota Yaris. It might be the GR, it might not be. It could be the Koenigs at Jumeirah, I suppose you could call that modern. The Bugatti, some of the Lamborghini Aventadors, I suppose that's modern. And I think Lamborghini Aventador today is up to second place. I don't know how it's gone from ninth to second, but it has. The Maserati MC20 is obviously always being considered. I don't know when we're going to get that. We say this pretty much every update, but this update surely seems like it's fitting for this car. It's modern. It's been leaked ages ago, if you're unaware of that. All of these cars on screen right now were leaked many, many months ago, and so far they've all came to the game, apart from just a couple, including the Maserati MC20. We're waiting on the Maserati MC20. It's a highly requested car. It's a modern update. Is this finally the update we get that? Probably not. <laughs> We've got the Ford Mustang down there, the Porsche 911 2019, which you think that's in the game if, if, if I'm not mistaken. So there's not actually many modern cars on that list, which definitely makes me think that it's going to be one of the ones I've just spoken about. It depends what Playground Games definition of modern is, really. And again, I am presuming here that because it's called Modern Horizons, all of the cars we're getting are modern. So there has been a couple of other cars leaked lately that we didn't get. The S5S Raptor was spotted on a tick 
TikTok made by Forza Horizon. We can see that it's in the game, as you can see on screen. We've still not received that. That's a modern car, so maybe this is the update that's coming. Um, Hennessy themselves, Hennessy Performance, they accidentally kind of told us, uh, unless it was a mistake, that the Venom 1200 Shelby GT500 Mustang is in the game when it's not in the game. They, they kind of said that it was. So I don't know if that's a hint that the Venom 1200 Shelby GT500 Mustang is coming at some point. I'd say that's fairly modern as well, so we can consider that. And of course, we've got the leaked car list as well. All of the leaks you can see on screen right now. Anything that's modern is certainly possible. Um, the GT3 RS is also a good guess. Anything, again, looks modern. The SLR McLaren, again, I don't think it's that because it's not modern and it's also the top requested car and that's not what the coming soon page says so i don't know obviously we're getting the ionic we already know we're getting that we're going to get whatever this highly requested car is so it's bound to be something from this list there's going to be more as well there's going to be more modern cars it's not just going to be two i don't think they've ever just added two new cars as far as i can remember and the last place to look for what modern cars might be coming is having a look at all the cars that have been added to forza motorsport as i keep saying cars that get added to motorsport do seem to eventually be coming to Horizon and vice versa. So these are all the cars that have been added to Motorsport. Some of them are already in Horizon 5, but the ones that aren't and that are modern, I don't see why we couldn't see them in Horizon 5 someday. Now, what else is on the coming soon page? There's a few things we can look into, I suppose. We've got new events. It always says that. New event lab props. Now, not every coming soon page says new event lab props, and we do often get new event lab props in updates that don't actually say it on this coming soon page so the fact that this does actually say new event lab props on this coming soon page makes me think that we're getting another big bundle of event lab props playground games have just been throwing event lab props at us in almost every update now even ones that again don't really focus on event lab so the fact that this modern horizons update has it as a widget maybe we're getting a nice big event lab pack again or maybe it's just a few i don't know it's hard to tell with playground games maybe they'll follow the theme of modern i don't know what kind of modern props you could have maybe modern buildings modern things rather than greenery I don't, I don't see what i mean so the event lab props could be any, anything really and a new collectible there's no way of knowing what that is it's something modern is what i'd guess so it looks like it could be an interesting update we'll find out on monday exactly what is coming i'm going to put a personal guess in of which car from this list is the one being added i'm going to go for the maserati mc20 at some point we're going to be correct and everything just lines up again with it being that car it's highly requested it was leaked months ago it's modern horizons my guess is the maserati what's your guess Keep an eye out for my video on Monday. As soon as the live stream has been released, I'll have a video on the channel detailing everything that's going to be in this update. And as always, car packs are always possible as well. Modern car pack is possibly coming. If there is a car pack, I'll be giving away a load of codes as well. So stay tuned for that. Leave a like if you've enjoyed, everyone. Tell me what you think is coming in update 35. I think we're on now and I'll see you all later.